9 million views in less than one day. Yeah, I think it's about 21 hours it's been up on YouTube. But this is Kendrick Lamar and Rihanna in a song, What Did You Expect? So here we go, track review time, because I haven't done one in two weeks. Kendrick Lamar, loyalty featuring Rihanna, the track review. Yeah, okay, I'll stop being crap. And by now, if you've been watching this channel for a while, you will know my free track review criteria is lyrics, music, and vocal performance. And we'll start with music. Um, compared to what I've heard from Kendrick's uh, choice in beats and productions, this one felt a bit thin on the ground production wise. I'm used to hearing samples, I'm used to like reggae vocals, I'm used to interesting instrumentation. However, this for me felt like someone had reversed a tr musical track and put a drum beat underneath it. Is it a bad tune? No, but there could be better on that. He could have picked better on that track, in my opinion. Um, vocal performances, we're going to have to split it into two. Kendrick Lamar, Rihanna. Kendrick Lamar... I think it somehow feels like it's a softer vocal from Kendrick compared to what I've heard in the past, compared to, let's say, Black of the Berry. Um, but it does fit the tune really well. However, this is not my favourite Kendrick Lamar vocal performance. This isn't Black of the Berry or... Um, the one about the prostitute, I forget the song's name, someone will put it in the comments. Um, I feel they had more emotion this one, in those ones. This one really didn't. But, that's my feeling. Rihanna, weak performance from Rihanna. I'm not being impressed with Rihanna for a while, this doesn't really help. She kind of goes back to that mumbly bullshit vocals that she has on work. And even though her vocals fix the tune, it's not her best vocal performance. This isn't Umbrella. This isn't Unfaithful. This isn't Diamonds. This is kind of a weak vocal performance. Okay. Lyrically. It feels like they're both talking to someone, however, it feels like a boring conversation. It's not a great, intelligent conversation. It doesn't superly work. It doesn't help the song either. Um, there's probably a lot of feeling behind it in the romance and the love in friendship but for me it's not lyrically brilliant should Kent bear fans well yeah Kendrick fans are gonna like this song Kendrick fans might be a bit indifferent about this song however if you're just coming to rap music and you hear this I don't think this is the best Kendrick performance to let you go into I would say if you want to get into Kendrick and you want to get into hip hop through Kendrick, I would listen to uh, to Pimper Butterfly and Mad City because the tracks on there are a lot better than this song in my opinion. And I'll see you next time. Peace.